In today's video, I'd like to address an issue that people have been having with the Apple Watch Series 9 and the Apple Watch Ultra 2, and I'm going to share a solution to that problem. So let's get into it. An issue that I've been seeing in the Apple support community is that people have been saying that their Apple Watch Series 9 or their Apple Watch Ultra 2 has been getting too dim. And I'd like to provide some background information on why that could be happening before I continue on with the solution. When Apple had announced the Apple Watch Series 9 and the Apple Watch Ultra 2, they talked about their displays. And one thing they did with both of these models was increase their brightness. So the Apple Watch Ultra 2 now has a new high brightness of 3000 nits, which is Apple's brightest display yet. And the Apple Watch Series 9 has a display brightness of up to 2000 nits. But alongside this, they also said that the Apple Watch Series 9 and the Apple Watch Ultra 2 could go down to as low as one nit. This, this has its benefits and it has its negatives. So let's say you're in a movie theater. This is the example Apple is using. If you're in a theater, you don't want your watch disturbing others. So by having the brightness go to one nit, it's less likely to disturb anyone. But this could also be a problem when you want to view the watch yourself and you don't really care if you're disturbing others or not. You want to just be able to view what's on the display. And this is where I think the problem's happening. Since the watch has a new low brightness, and a lot of this is happening in the dark, it seems, based off the Apple support community, that's probably the play cause in this issue. And not everyone's gonna like this, especially if you have vision problems, that lower brightness isn't gonna really help you. So in reality, there is no problems with the Apple Watch Series 9 and the Apple Watch Ultra 2. They're just acting as they were intended. So you may wonder, What's the solution here? Well, let's get into that right now. So the first thing you're gonna to wanna to make sure is that you're updated to watchOS 10.4. So to check, you're gonna to go to settings, then we're gonna scroll down until we see general, then we're gonna click on software update. And if there's any new updates, they will show up right here. And as we're up to date, we're not gonna have any updates available. So now let's just show you where in settings to turn this solution on. So back to the main section in settings, we're gonna scroll down until we see accessibility. And then we're gonna scroll down until we see this new toggle called minimum brightness. So if you wanna turn this on, it will increase the brightness of your display when in darker environments, which is the main issue that people have been having. And that's all you have to do to fix the minimum brightness on your Apple Watch. This just goes to show that Apple truly does listen to feedback in the community. And their good way to let Apple know of your feedback is through the feedback page that they have on their website. I'm gonna link that down below in the description. And if you ever wanna provide feedback to Apple regarding anything, their devices, their software, their apps, you can check that out down below. Anyways, guys, hope you found this video useful. Subscribe for more videos like this, and I'll see you in the next one.